Oh, Marcy, Gigi and I have missed you so much. Oh, I've missed you, too. And I guess that's not all I've missed, <laughs> No, huh? seven and a half months pregnant. Oh. Yeah, we're both doing great. It's a miracle. Yeah. Part of me still can't believe it. Wow. But, well, that's why I wanted to be here today. For Chloe? Of course. A year ago today, I said goodbye to her. You know something, Marcy? You were one of the few people who ever saw her. I'm awfully glad you were with her. Well, I wanted to... wanted her to know that her life meant something. It mattered. Oh, God. She may not have been the baby that I was gonna adopt, but she still mattered to me. She mattered to so many people. Oh, she did. She did. <laughs> you know, in a strange way, I kind of have her to thank for this. I guess you do, because if you and Michael hadn't grieved together... Yeah, over... we may not have ever gotten back together. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, how do you like Seattle? We love it. Oh, you do? Yeah, we do, and we actually just started house hunting. Oh, you mean there's no way to get you back here to land? Oh, maybe not. Oh. But I did also come back because I'm still registered to vote here, and I'm happy to report that I got back in time to vote for you for mayor. <laughs> Have the returns started to come in? Zero precincts reporting. This might take a while. Well, then, it is Hope's birthday. Um, maybe we should just, um, mute. I really hope Dorian wins. Yeah, I know. I know you do. So, you never told me who you voted for. That's right. I didn't. Hey, Dorian. Why don't you introduce me to your missus? Amelia Bennett. You do not have to talk to this jackass. Now, sweetheart, I'm sure Mr. Manning just wants to get to know me. Of course, sweetheart. Hey, so which one of you two is the groom, anyway? Have you ever rented a, a movie at a motel room? Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> it's nothing like that. It's a child's <laughs> birthday party. Just keep that in mind. I'm just trying to get to know my guests. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure I know everything I need to about you. Hey, I got her. Okay, come on. Oh, it's, uh, it's kind of unbelievable, huh? I know. Only Hope could get a group like this together in one room. <laughs> well, a year ago today, we thought there was no Hope. I mean, how could this day not bring us all together? Well, Langston, I couldn't set it better myself. All right, now, everyone together? <laughs> Look at my Look at One, two, three. Cheese! Look, I know you're upset about seeing the sonic rap thing, okay? What, this? I can't even tell it's a baby. Who do you think the little nipper looks like? My slut sister? Gigi, don't do that. I don't even know if it looks like Rex. It's been so long since I've seen him. I barely remember what he looks like. Okay, I'm gonna get you out of here. I don't want to be alone. Where's Shane? I told you he's with Mo and Noelle. They're no, I, watching. Yeah, I know that. At, at their place or your place? Mine! Of course. Of course, I would never do anything in... Okay, I don't I don't want Shane to see you like this. Me either. Alright, so maybe we can just maybe we can hang out in, in John's back office or something I like that for a little bit. I don't want to stay here. Well, where do you suggest we go? Let's go to your place. Loki PD's on the way and we got an EMT for Rex. He's still not coming around. What'd you give him? Just something to make him sleep. What's the matter with you? Your Rex is on. How could you do this to him? Uh, he'll be fine. And why did you team up with this one? Nice way to talk about your own sister. You two wanted us out of the way. You needed us out of the way. Why? God, I need to talk to Jessica. Do you, do you know if she's all right? You called me. You told no, me no, to no, come no, wait, here. Wait, you wait. sound like Nash. How did you sound like Nash? Wait, I didn't call you. Well, you just said it was you. Just trouble. What? Yes, stalking you. What? I figured Natalie told you. That you were stalking me? It wasn't me. It was because of me. Wayne Landers was the one doing this. So you didn't make any calls? No. And you didn't tell me to come here? No. You're lying. Oh, just you know, you've been lying to my entire family the whole time, pretending to take care of me, but really you've been using my memories to hurt me. <laughs> no, I'm tired of listening. I'm going home for my daughter. I'm getting the hell out of here. Just, I'm sorry, I can't. What? You were up to your ass, Nadine. 
Your best bet is to tell us what's going on. Okay, someone made me call you. Get you to come here. We need a name, Nadine. What are you gonna do to me? I just need you to listen. To what? What happened the night I got to the lodge? Pamela Stewart. You killed her. No. And you killed the guy that was pretending to be Nash. I didn't kill anyone. Then why won't you let me go? Oh my God. What did you do to Natalie? 